the state of our city. As I interact with many fine folks representing cities and towns across the state of Indiana, it's very apparent to me that what we have here in Warsaw, Indiana is what many others can only strive for. We are blessed indeed to live in this community. And that is testimony to the values and work ethic of our citizens, the selfless motivation and energy of our community partners, the foresight and tenacity of our homegrown businesses, and all of our industrial and commercial partners. Population growth is a key indicator of a city's viability. Today, more people call Warsaw their home than ever. The most recent 2014 U.S. Census estimates lists our population at 14,280. That's up 5.3% since the last official census in 2010. In comparison, the state has grown at a rate of 1.7%. State federal road funded reconstruction of East Market Street from Argonne Road to Bronson Street was a significant collaboration of local community resources. This project included road, curb, gutter, lighting, sidewalk, bike path, sanitary sewer, and stormwater improvements. The results have created a safer, more controlled neighborhood traffic corridor with enhanced residential parking. It has also improved connectivity for cyclists and pedestrians to our schools, parks, and the entire trail system from our neighbors in Winona Lake to the Chinworth Bridge Trailhead west of the Phase II in-dot portion of the Market Street reconstruction is currently being engineered and will extend the same improvements from Bronson Street to Hickory Street downtown. The financial health of the city of Warsaw remains good. The effects of ta tax caps continues to slow revenue growth, while road funding continues to lag woefully behind. Careful spending and continued cost savings will allow us to counter those losses. Fiscal year 2016, the city budget allocation process yielded an increase in the tax rate of only one cent, which amounts to a 0.8% increase. The council worked hard to keep spending requests down without cutting services. Another indicator of our financial health is that the city of Warsaw maintained its current bond credit rating this year as a double A minus from Standard and Poor's after a recent city securities credit analysis. In July, a ribbon cutting was held to open the first phase of expansion in the Warsaw Tech Park, featuring a 62,500 square foot shell building, the extension of Polk Drive, sewer and utility expansion, and three shovel-ready sites with fiber didn't take long to attract interest in the park. Less than six weeks later, on August 25th, Banner Medical, an orthopedic manufacturing supplier, broke ground on one of those sites to develop a 45,000 square foot facility, investing over $8 million in creating 76 high-tech new jobs in Warsaw. Our leaders here today recognize that we have been blessed with the quality of life, amenities, and natural resources to make the city of Warsaw a desirable community. But what makes the city of Warsaw our home are the men, women, and children who invest their lives and resources to pursue not only their dreams, but for the betterment of their neighbors as well. In that respect, our state of the city is 